After three water tragedies in just three days, Racine leaders are urgently trying to find a fix. Fox 6's Aaron Mabin live at North Beach tonight with the new calls being made to hopefully save lives. And Aaron, officials don't want to close the beach like they have a section of McKinley Beach, but they want people to enjoy the water safely, right? That's right, Mary. No plans to close any Racine Beach right now. There is a focus right now to add more signs and lifeguards to beaches. After a string of recent incidents, leaders are saying enough is enough. As far as I'm concerned, we're done watching this occur. In the wake of drownings and water rescues from Lake Michigan, Racine County Sheriff Christopher Schmeling making this request. Today, I wanted to call upon city leadership to examine the lifeguard situation that we have down there. Proposing more lifeguards, extended hours, and better signage at area beaches. Talking about rip tides, rip currents, undertoes, and things of this nature not near piers and, and rock structures. The push comes after three separate incidents along Racine's Lakeshore in three days. A 10-year-old girl and 17-year-old boy died after being pulled from the lake over the weekend. Two 14-year-old girls were rescued from Racine's North Beach Monday evening. Captain Bradley Friend describing the water conditions. In Racine here off of North Beach, we have the concrete causeway that forms part of our harbor. This is a very natural area for those rip currents to exist. Racine Mayor Corey Mason says the city is looking at adding lifeguards and more. There's certainly an evaluation that we're doing internally about is there more that we can do on water safety, whether that's around education or signage or whatever it might be. Meanwhile, at North Beach, people are aware of the recent tragedies and keeping safety top of mind. Just so sorry for those families. It's got to be awful. It took just minutes yesterday for Racine County crews to rush to those two 14 year olds in this area yesterday. As for those two 14 year olds, one right now just has a little bit of scratches. She's expected to be OK. The other one is fighting for her life. We're live in Racine. Aaron Maven, Fox 6 News. All right, Aaron, thank you.